Now that gives you a distributed version control system. We mean that you can work locally, but you also share your change to the server. And in the process, you work with many members in your team, and each member works on different feature. When you want to start a new feature, you have to create a branch, and you can work on multiple features in a single repository by switching between them. And I am not a mother, I just want to share my experience to people who want to know about this. In this video, I focus on the below things here. Create a new brand, how to switch to another brand, merge chain from a brand, and the last one is how to resolve conflicts if it happens. And now we go to the first part, how to create a new brand. You can see that I have a repository with the with one brand here in master branch, and now I want to create a new brand called development branch. Okay, now we have a development branch, and uh, we are on development branch, and this brand is created from master brand. So the cores in development branch it is same with. Um, the core in matter brand. So this brand is just on your local and you have to push uh, brand to the remote brand and your team member can see that brand. You can push it now or change something and push this brand later. I will push it later. And now I made some change on the file in this brand by adding the new line here. Okay, and you can see that the chain of the file in this brain display here. Okay, now we move to the second point, how to switch to another branch. You can see that we are on development brain, and I want to switch back to master. How can I do? Uh, the first step, you have to commit on chain in the current branch. In this case, I have to commit on chain in development branch. Okay, and you can post it now or put it later. Now I will put it later. And you just jump place on master branch, and now you are on master branch. Okay, now we go to the third point: how to merge chain from development branch to master branch. Now you can see that in development brand you have some chain and now you want to merge this chain to master brand. How can I do? I just right click on the development branch and do merge development into current brand. It means that's into master brand. Okay, and you can see that there's uh, the chain will be move to master brand now you should boot the chain to remote branch okay in this case i put the two brand okay and you can check in the git lab to see the chain and you can see that the master branch have the chain from the development branch because we have we just merged from development to master Now we go to the last point, how to resolve conflict when merged from brand to another branch. Now, uh, now I will make the chain to be conf conflicted and by uh, I will change something in the master brand directly in the GitLab here. And you, you can see that, as I mentioned before, I moved from development to master. It's very easy because there is no con conflict happen. But in this case, I will, will do some change in the master branch and put it to my local. Okay, and now I come back to development branch. And I will also do some change in development branch. 
and I met some change in the same line and you can see that in the first line of this form yeah. and this line will be conflict because it changed from uh, two brand to brand matching uh, the same line yeah it different content so it will be uh, conflict this will be conflict this in this case so I put the chain to development okay you can check again in development and in the matter is a different uh, content and now we come back to matter brand and I also merge from development to matter brand like before but in this case you can see the one in positive play uh, is uh, say that the something conflict happened okay so you have to multi chain manually and you can see the one in icon display on the flower yeah on the flower here now i go to merge chain and you can see that it will is it separated into into parts the first is the head and the second is the development so you you can see that it's uh, just one line but have two content and you have to choose the content you want to keep and the line number six is no chain because it's the same in the two branch and now you have to choose the line you want in the case i keep the line in development branch okay that's all and now i just come back to short and commit the chain then the first thing you have to say and you can see that the one in icon is there yeah and i will commit the chain and put this put the matter branching to matter remote and now we go back to the gitlab to see the chain Okay, you can see that in this case, the chain from development brand go to the master brand here. Okay, that's it, the simple demo to help you resolve conflict if this happen when you must from this brand to another brand. Thank you for your watching.